many refugees are there? Altogether in the uh, registered refugees, there are 120,000 people, more than this, inside the camps. Registered, but a lot of the camps, like the Sham camps, aren't. No camps for Sham people. No. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, they didn't get the, the chance to establish their I mean, own camps. How many people now are displaced and re relocated or? I mean, uh, internally, or? Uh, we do the research uh, uh, in our own territory. And then people estimate, you know, because... What, to The definition of the IDP is also difficult, also. Mm -hmm. uh, we can see in our current area, uh, we will talk about the percentage. Mm -hmm. 70% of the population they are displaced. So I don't know how many people are in the current state, but in numbers I can say that not less than 100,000 people because it, it, it's only in the current state, not the whole, I mean, uh, I'm not included other areas. But the Korean refugees, you know, it was started in 1984. Mm -hmm. It's been 21 years. Or 20 years, we can see, because they can set up the <coughs> the camp in 1984. So, if you compare the refugees and the internally displaced IDPs, I think that refugees are more uh, looked after by the NGOs, mm -hmm. and then the we can see that they have a safe area or safe place to stay inside Thailand. The relief, the medical and ed education NGOs, they are working very hard for the refugees along the border. But all the assistance or relief, they have to ask permission from Thai's authority. Because I think that if the refugees' uh, condition is better in food or education or health, it's like a pull factor for other displaced people to come and stay inside the refugees. Mm -hmm. And then it will become a big burden for the Thais. That's why Thai you know, don't want to give a good education system, a good health system inside the camp. So it was very limited. So the NGOs, you know, doing their best, but whenever you would like to do things, you have to ask permission from the Thais. And with the IDBs inside, I think that they have a hard time. So <coughs> the relief uh, cannot give assistance directly the relief agency or NGOs cannot give assistance directly. So the the current setup, the two uh, local NGOs can say, trying to help the people.